Hi, it's TR back with another truck camper renovation slash restoration video. And today we're going to be putting the rear back together. Yeah, I got everything fit up. Laminated panels, you saw that in the last episode. This episode, we're going to do the final fit up, get all the walls plumbed up inside, get everything reattached. I got a little demo to do on this wall. Uh, another coat of paint on this interior wall over here. Get those drying uh, while I demo this wall, and then we'll be ready to put this back frame back together. So uh, that's the plan for today. If I can get this out of the way. <laughs> I'm put that on the blooper reel. Get up there. Thank you. It won't stay. All right, let's get some paint. We got a little fluffing stuff on those. Let's throw some air at them. Let me get some air here. So I got a couple of things going on in this paint. And since this is the rear wall, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just touch these up real quick. nothing to screw to up there all right let's see about bringing this corner down now let's get a clamp on it let's get this ladder out of the way so you can see so i'm not wasting electrons Quit, they quit. It's not camera batteries, it's tool batteries.
like it. It's looking damn good. Solid as a rock. Oh yeah, nice and solid. I'm loving that. All right, as you can see, it's uh, time for a break. All right, I'm on the last wall here. It's been a bugger. I've had to stretch and stretch and pull it back and forth and my camera's overheated twice. And hello, Mr. Uh, House Sparrow. There's a sparrow nest right behind you. I'll show you. Oh, can you see that up there? So well, that's why there's always loud bird sounds. They got a pretty piece of tinsel up there. <clears throat> uh, let's see, I need the other drill. Of course, oh well, I'm up here, I might as well. that down I got a pocket full of screws alrighty oh, I need to be on this outside that's where I need to be is up here whoops so much for that level it's not level anymore oh there's already a screw hole up here hopefully it lined up right Oops. I really wanted a two and a half for up here, but this will be fine. Shit to bed. Shisa. Shisa cough. Shice cough. I need that. Hammer. Hammer. Where is the ha hammer? Right there. Oh, I'm gonna need long drill for that. Okay. Well, let's get the. We need long drill, long screws. That's gonna be tricky. Huh? That's gonna be tricky. Getting this tight in here. I sure didn't like the feel of that. Oh, that 
probably went through. Felt like it went through the wall. It's far too hot to be working out in this sun. Four inch screws. Maybe I will need that. Just get that good and tight. it feels like i've had a great day i got everything fit back together it's all for fairly plumb there's still a little bit of work to do with this back here it's a little bit racked this way so once i get the roof on and get the racking out of it we'll be in good shape so in the next video we're going to finish up that roof framing we've got three pieces three sections of the roof to finish up i've actually got one of the sections already built uh sitting in the garage right now but uh, we'll get that taken care of. When we do that, we'll get the rack out of this back. Oh, and by the way, I wanna mention, you might notice that some of these members are a little bit racked in the, in the, in the frame. And when I was squaring up the frame at initial glue up, uh, these two seem to rack out to get this thing into square. So they're not exactly perpendicular plumb, which drives my OCD crazy, but there's nothing I can do about it at this point. So it is what it is. So if you found value in this video, give me that thumbs up. I always appreciate that. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Ring the notification bell. Got a lot of videos still to come on the truck camper restoration. But for now, it's time to go. Thanks for watching. I sure do appreciate it. Till we get together for another truck camper restoration video. Peace.